There are just 46 Commonwealth war graves here in Ranville Churchyard. These were some of the first men to arrive in Normandy on the 6th of June, 1944. And tragically, they were some of the very first to die. But they would not be the last. In early June 1944, the then empty field neighbouring the churchyard was first used for burials. Today, Ranville War Cemetery is the final resting place of more than two and a half thousand Commonwealth and German servicemen. As you walk amongst these ordered rows, you see hundreds of graves of airborne soldiers, men dropped behind enemy lines on D-Day. And this was originally known as the Airborne Cemetery. One of those men was 19-year-old Emile Courtille. He was his unit's dog handler, and he arrived in France with his Alsatian paratroop dog, Glenn. Neither survived the first day of the Battle of Normandy, and it's believed that Glenn is buried here with Emile. In 1947, a party of loved ones made a pilgrimage here to Ranville. They were met by the mayor of Ranville and upon their departure, he told them they were not leaving their menfolk like strangers in a foreign land, but as angels of deliverance, sleeping amongst those they had come to deliver. 